A 4.45 alarm clock on a Sunday morning can only mean one thing. Ollie Kane's running a little bit late. I've got two questions. One, will he be running? And two, will he be wearing his hat? Random search yet again. It's all the camera equipment you've got in your uh, case, mate. We're going to dump it. I had a little bit of a panic. I thought I had secured our car insurance, but not the car. But it turns out, I just had the wrong email up, but we're just waiting to get the bus to go pick up our car. A lovely Volkswagen Polo. Absolutely beautiful. Where to now then, Johnny? So we're just checking the car for any dents or scratches, and then we are on the way to Longford to see the team for what promises to be a brilliant event. Height of technology. Do we know? What did you make a long for so far, Johnny? Absolutely beautiful. They've got what can only be described as a green squirrel. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Thank you for correcting me, Charles. See you a lot of videos. <laughs> Yeah, no. How are you? Hey, you well? Yeah, right, mate. Hey, thanks. How are you doing? Holly Keen, fancy seeing you here. Yeah. Hey, how do you do it with both your eyes open? So we're just getting set up. We're going in the finishing touches. Um, I'm waiting for the children to arrive. We've got uh, 30 odd tots set to arrive in a minute, so I'm waiting for them to, to arrive. And I'm on the camera. Tell us about who we got down from Northern Ireland then, Kiefer. We got Super Michael Woods and Super Noel O'Donnell. Michael obviously runs his franchise in Portadown in Guildford, and Noel is up in Derry slash London Derry. So really thrilled to be here today with these two absolute superstars. Tell us what we've got planned today then, Rob. Well, we've got Tots football starting in about half an hour. Can't wait to get started. Then we've got our football fun and development session straight after half two to half three. We're expecting to have over eight the children with us uh, this afternoon and we're absolutely buzzing. All good? We're on your There we go. It's made to be on me. Okay. Yeah, I feel great. Tell us who we've got here, Johnny. We've got Chris. Chris is set to join us. First football fan factory head coach in Dublin. <laughs> taking over the vlog from Super Ollie Kane for a couple of minutes. You can see Ollie behind me taking some videos. And you can also see superstar Noel and superstar head coach Michael running a TOTS football fun session. So I'm going to jump in to their TOTS session and show you what it's all about. Super Noel is running a session called Superheroes where all the superheroes are playing different football activities as that superhero. And as you can see, the latest superhero is Spider-Man. Johnny Morton is behind me and congratulating all the kids and parents on a fantastic Tots Football Fun session and also preparing everyone for a behind the scenes group photo. So I'm looking forward to seeing his organization skills in full action. What's going on, okay? Taking a group photo, we're going to see how it goes. How's Johnny organization skills been? See in a minute whether he's outside. Now outside, on the sunny AstroTurf here in Longford, sun is shining. We're set to welcome around 80 children in about half hour, so we're just getting set up at the moment. Here comes Johnny right now. Hey! Ready for a big session? Oh Hopefully. man, I'm absolutely buzzing. 80 kids set to come out on this AstroTurf. The sun is shining, the coaches are buzzing. It's going to be a glorious session. What would you make of the weather, Kiefer? Absolutely glorious here. Ireland is incredible when the sun is shining. Longford is an absolutely lovely place to be. The sun is shining right in the 3G pitch. What else could you want? We are the Football Fun Factory. As you can probably tell, 
by my accent. We flew over this morning, me and Ollie, to come here, especially today, to see you lot play football, because apparently you lot are absolutely amazing. Is that true? Yeah! Epic day then, Johnny. Mate, epic day. Just got to the hotel in Athlone after a brilliant, brilliant afternoon. So many children running around with smiles on their faces. But now, I'm ready to go to bed, okay? So turn the camera off. It's bedtime. We've got a big day tomorrow. Morning, Johnny. Morning, okay. What is the plan for today? So today, we are heading over to Longford Centre Park to deliver our training for the amazing staff over there. made it to Longford Forest. Uh, we're just going to meet up with Rob and then we're going to head down to the Sports Plaza um, and we're going to be meeting all the, the Centre Park team. What did you make of this then Rob? Absolutely incredible. Absolutely amazing. Great to see it all set up. Looking forward to a good day. So with this training what we're going to do is we're going to do a bit of a welcome session with everyone inside one of the classrooms. Then we're going to come out here into the sports arena. And we're going to do some top sessions. We're going to do some family challenge stuff and some football fun factory experience sessions and then we're going to go out on the actual turf this afternoon and hopefully catch a bit of the Irish sun. We now have over 90 franchisees across England, Scotland, Wales, Ireland, Northern Ireland. The mission is to put smiles on faces. The goal is for us to become the world's leading children's football coaching organisation. Yeah, mate, great start. Uh, the guys are full of beans and energy, as always. It's always fun delivering tots to adults, making them run around like a dinosaur, fly around like Buzz Lightyear. Uh, so that was absolutely class. Um, and now we are going to get the inflatable dartboard up to show them our football fun factory experience and also our family challenge, which has been a huge, huge hit at Centre Park. Just heading out to the Astro Turf, ready for our sessions this afternoon. Uh, very special location, Astro Turf, the middle of the forest. I'm not going to lie, pretty naked, but um, being Your a hair's all over the place as well. Absolutely class, mate. Brilliant finish out on the Asher Turf in the middle of the forest with a group of fantastic people and coaches. And, uh, yeah, absolutely buzzing. Now let's uh, head to the airport and go home. Just leaving the forest and on our way to Dublin Airport. One of the maddest 48 hours, what we've crammed into the last two days has been absolutely bonkers, but um, absolutely loved every single second, apart from maybe this bit right now, because I'm pretty keen to get home and uh, ready for a big day in the office tomorrow.